It appears the feds are getting set for a major boost in military spending. During a policy speech in Ottawa, the foreign affairs minister said Canada can no longer rely on the U.S. for global leadership, and it's time for our country to help fill that void. Why invest billions to maintain a capable, professional, well-funded, and well-equipped Canadian military? The answer is obvious. To rely solely on the U.S. security umbrella would make us a client state. The fact that our friend and ally has come to question the very worth of its mantle of global leadership puts into sharper focus the need for the rest of us to set our own clear and sovereign course. Freeland never mentioned Donald Trump by name during her speech, but did say she was deeply disappointed in the U.S. from pulling out of the Paris Climate Accord. Opposition leaders were quick to criticize the Liberals for not providing any specifics on foreign policy. To hear a speech uh, that was so empty of detail and reality, uh, I think, is a, uh, is a sad commentary on, uh, on the Liberal position on foreign policy. And again, I, we see that as a very last-minute belated cover for the defense policy review, which will be announced tomorrow. The message we have to give to the Trump administration is not only in this House of Commons, but it's through our decisions and our in actions on the international scene day after day. And on that, I'd like to see Canada take a stronger stance. Now, no specific numbers were revealed today, though that could come tomorrow when the defense minister lays out his plan for our Canadian military.